What's up everybody? My name is Jeremy Jones and I'm back with another video. Today we're talking to Nike Dunk Low, Big Money Savings. So stay tuned. Hoping one day I'ma get it all right. Brother is engaged, but I started my own life. Yeah, I haven't had a chill day. Really wanna vibe, appreciate the moments. I've been creating not scrolling. Mom and dad still support it. Alright, man, I'm back with another video, man. Before I get too deep into this video, y'all already know what to do. Go and hit that like button. It really helps the channel out. And if you know, instead of subscribing, I made content about sneakers. Alright, so let's dive in today's video. Just like I said in the intro, man, we're talking to Nike Dunk Low, big money savings. All right, man, we're gonna be keeping things very simple over today. We're gonna be answering the basic old question. Are they drip or skip? Let's just keep it there. All right, so first things first, these are set to release April 17th, to the best of my knowledge, coming in at a retail price of $125, right? Okay, and of course, you know the kid glanced at the resale price, and right now, look like they're roughly averaging $160 and up, depending on the size, right? Okay, now I am gonna say this right off rip. This shoe makes me think of the Nike Dunk Barbershop joints. I don't think those were SBs. Correct me if I'm wrong down in the comment section, but those dropped in 2022. And here we are, it's look like it's like a spin-off, but where here's the changes to me, right? That's sticking out also that I noticed. Um, they're coming with three sets of laces, but out of those three sets of laces, one of those laces that is coming in is those rope laces. And to be honest, I don't think we I'll say, I'll speak for myself. I haven't seen the rope laces on any shoe, like originally from Nike, other than the Travis Scott SB um, dunks where those had the rope laces, and here we are, we got them on these joints. Now this is SB Pro to the best of my knowledge, right? Okay, so I'm guessing the quality on these are probably even better. Overall, not a bad shoe, but again, Nike, it's something that I feel like if you got the barbershops, which looks like, to be honest, if you take minus the rope laces, and I'm sorry to compare the two, but I can't help it, but if you take the rope laces from these joints, the big money savings, which I also found out that it's also big money savings, but it also could be called the live, love, laugh joints as well. Um, but I'm gonna stick to big money savings because I feel like that's what we all kind of just know as, but um, when I was doing research on the shoe, that's one of the things that I seen about these. Um, if you are a Nike SB Dunk, Head, I can see why you would want these. Um, and I'm gonna say this. Yes, Nike Dunk and Nike SB Dunk and Nike, yeah, Nike SB Dunks and then Nike SB, totally three different shoes, right? Okay, Nike Dunks are different. You should know that at this point. And if not, I'm just gonna break it down real quick. And then you got the Nike SBs, totally different. And then you got the Nike SB Dunks, which is a combination, I feel like, of the two, right? Okay. But I feel like this big money savings, it says on the tongue. Also, one of the things I saw this too is that inside of that tongue, not only are you getting extra laces, but there is like a price tag where I guess it's like, it looks like they're getting a certain percentage off, but I don't think you're getting a percentage off the price, but I feel like that's a part of the advertisement, right? Okay, again, allegedly, I don't know. This is just what it looks like from the outside looking in. Um, overall, dope shoe. I feel like this is another shoe where it's gonna sell out and it's probably gonna hit the skate shops first. They did everything right and these are loaded up on the sneakers out. However, it's kind of one of those, is this a little too late for a shoe like this? Probably not, cause it's probably still gonna sell out, but it's, I'm gonna say this, I don't wanna bash the shoe, but all it does for me is make a think of like other sneakers that I really, really wanted dunk wise. Um, those barbership, barber shop joints, why I may not go crazy for them, but it made me think of those. And then there's other shoes where I'm like, you know what? Say this 125 and put it on something else. So if you haven't figured out for the kid, these will be a skip. Not a bad shoe, but it's kind of one of those. I feel like Nike didn't strike with an iron is hot, even though I know these shoes will sell out. Um, but I guess for me being a collector and you know I'm being very selective this year, for the kid, these will be a skip. But I want to know what you guys think down in the comment section. And we'll be going after these on April 17th retailing at $125 and of course let me know if you think they're drip or skip all right man i'm gonna get up out of thing and stop rambling man y'all be sure to hit that like button it really helps the channel out and if you know 
consider subscribing i made content about sneakers again my name is jeremy jones and thank you for watching and i'm out